sugar together. out of the microwave. after. frosting and add the first layer on I place the remaining cake layers over the frosting after that I spread chocolate frosting all over the cake and smooth it evenly I arrange the chocolate bars around the cake. And put fondant on the top of it. Thank you. 
one more cake mixture. I put the cake in the mold and baked it. For making colorful frosting, I use butter, powdered sugar, and mix it with food coloring. into heart shape. I spread the bottom layer with white frosting and add the first layer on. the remaining cake layers over the frosting. After that, I spread white frosting all over the cake. And smooth it evenly. I do the same with the second tier, but with red frosting. I pipe the rainbow frosting all around the cake. I put fondant heart on the top for final decoration. So beautiful! Delicious! Go away! Oh no! My cake! I have to make another one! First, I crack an egg through a sieve to separate yolk and white. Mix vanilla, milk, cooking oil with the yolk. For the white, I will whisk it up with sugar. After that, I mix the bowls of yolk and white together. Now I pour flour, cocoa powder here and keep mixing. I take the bowl of melted white chocolate out of the microwave and mix it with food coloring. I spread the bottom layer with white frosting and add the first layer on. I place the remaining cake layers over the frosting. After that, I spread chocolate frosting all over the cake. And smooth it evenly. Then, I 
and place a smaller one above to have a two-tier cake. I place rainbow fondant balls around the base of both tiers. Next, I pour rainbow melted chocolate on the top of the second tier. Finally, I place an ice cream in the middle of this cake. Wow! So beautiful! I love it! Na, 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 na. Na, 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 na. Ah! I will make a new version of this cake. Looks so pretty. I love it. 
Welcome to my home. I will make a huge cake for you today.
It's so beautiful! Wow. Hi, can I have a cake like this? Oh no, it's sold out! Please wait for a moment. First, I crack an egg through a sieve to separate yolk and white. vanilla, milk, cooking oil with the yolk. For the white, I whisk it up with sugar. After that, I mix the bowls of yolk and white together. I put flour, sprinkles here, and keep mixing. and mix it with food coloring. I make small colorful balls with fondant. I 
Spread the bottom layer with chocolate frosting. And add the first layer on. I place the remaining cake layers over the frosting. After that, I spread white frosting all over the cake. And smooth it evenly. Then, I place a smaller one above to have a two-tier cake. I decorate the cake with fondant ball and rainbow frosting. Let's try my cake. Oh no, is it so terrible? Don't be sad, I will make another one for you. First, I crack an egg through a sieve to separate yolk and white. vanilla, milk, cooking oil with the yolk. For the white, I will whisk it up with sugar. After that, I mix the bowls of yolk and white together. Now I pour flour, cocoa powder here and keep mixing. white chocolate out of the microwave and mix it with food coloring. I spread the bottom layer with white frosting and add the first layer on. Place the remaining cake layers over the frosting. After that, I spread chocolate frosting all over the cake. And smooth it evenly. Then, I place a smaller one above to have a two-tier cake. rainbow melted chocolate on the top of the second tier. I pipe rain 
rainbow buttercream into swirls along the body of the first two. I insert two rainbow chocolate bars in the middle of this cake. And scatter some sprinkles onto the cake like this. So beautiful. I love it. Oh no, I think this is a new idea for my cake today. favorite Oreo cookie. Thank you very much. Wow. It looks so pretty. I love it. Be careful. Thanks for your delivery. Bye-bye. To make the cake batter, I mix egg, milk, cooking oil, sugar, and flour together. Next, I pour melted Kit Kat here and keep mixing. This is 
melted white chocolate I prepared before. I will add food coloring here to have rainbow melted chocolate. Then, I pour them in this mold. And let them cool in 30 minutes. I spread the bottom layer with chocolate frosting. And add the first layer on. I place the remaining cake layers over the frosting. After that, I spread chocolate frosting all over the cake. And smooth it evenly. the rainbow chocolate bars around the cake body. I pour melted chocolate on top of this cake. Place a round ball of white fondant covered with sprinkles in the center of the cake. So beautiful! I love it! What are you doing, Tom? Go out! I have to make a cake right now.
So pretty. Mix egg, milk, cooking oil, and sugar together. to pound random candy and put them in the cake mix. Colorful chocolate. I put red, orange, green, blue, purple food coloring in the white chocolate. brown frosting and add the first layer on. I place remaining cake layer over the frosting. I spread a brown layer of frosting around the sides and across the top. After that, press gently to set it in place. chocolate in rainbow color order. Ah, the fondant. And the mandem candy are for decoration. Delicious. Tasty. Yummy. So naughty. 
I have to make another one. First, I'll take the rainbow fondants out of the fridge. Then I roll the fondant blocks into two thin threads and braid them together. And now, we will move on to baking. I mix egg, milk, cooking oil, sugar, and flour together. Next, I pour the cake mixture into the mold and put it into the oven. I spread the bottom layer with chocolate frosting and add the first layer on. Place the remaining cake layer over the frosting. After that, I spread chocolate frosting around the cake. And press gently to set in place. I wrap the fondant braids around the body of the cake in rainbow color order. I pour colorful melted chocolate on the top of the cake in the same order. This heart will be the final decoration for my cake today. Wow, I love it! Delicious! Tasty! They are so beautiful. How much do they cost? If you buy both, it only costs $2. Here you are. Thank you. Now, I dice watermelon, mango, and avocado. Cook watermelon with sugar until they become a sticky mixture. It is watermelon jam. I also make mango and avocado become jams in the same way. Next, I melt gelatin powder with a little water in the microwave. Piggy, thanks for your help. Since I can't buy blueberries, I'll use the available blueberry jam. I pour melted gelatin into the jam bowls and mix them up.
After that, I pour jelly mixture in the mold. And let them cool in 30 minutes. Looks so pretty. I love it. Oh no. I will make another one. Delicious! Tasty! Wow! Yummy! cake will I make today? Oh, strawberry. Let's make a cake now. Firstly, I put egg, cooking oil, milk, and sugar into a bowl. I 
Also add flour, strawberry powder in here and mix them up. This is melted chocolate which I prepared before. I will add food coloring to make rainbow melted chocolate. I spread the bottom layer with white frosting and add the first layer on. I place the remaining cake layer over the frosting. I spread white frosting around the cake. After that, I press gently to set it in place. Next, I place the chocolate bars around the cake in the rainbow color order. I also pour colorful melted chocolate on the top of this cake in the same order. A fondant strawberry will be the final decoration for this cake. Wow, I love it! Delicious! Tasty! What's wrong with you? Oh, is this a secret gift? Let's take it home and make a cake now. Firstly, I mix flour, cornstarch, and cocoa powder together. After that, I add egg, milk, cooking oil, sugar here and continue mixing.
is melted white chocolate I prepared before. Let's add food coloring here to have rainbow melted chocolate. the bottom layer with white frosting and add the first layer on. I place the remaining cake layer over the frosting. After that, I spread chocolate frosting around the cake and smooth it in this way. I pour rainbow melted chocolate on the edge of this cake. And arrange corresponding colored fondant balls above. I place mandem candies around the base in rainbow color order. Finally, I pipe chocolate buttercream into the star shape in the middle of the top. Wow, I love it! Delicious! Tasty! chocolate is delivered already. Let's make a cake with me now. Firstly, I break and melt this white chocolate bar. Now, I move on to making the cake batter. I will mix egg, milk, cooking oil, and sugar together. Also add flour and matcha powder here. With the melted white chocolate, I'll mix in some food coloring to create rainbow melted chocolate. I spread the bottom layer with white frosting and add the first layer on. I place the remaining cake layer over the frosting. After that, I spread white frosting all over the cake and smooth it evenly. Next, I pour rainbow melted chocolate on the top of the cake. rainbow fondant balls around the cake base. Finally, I insert a heart with fondant and sprinkles on the top of this cake. Wow, I love it! Delicious! 
tasty. Oh no! My ice cream! Sorry, I will make another special ice cream for you. I mix egg, milk, flour, sugar, cooking oil, and chocolate chips together. I make colorful fondant balls to decorate the cake after. Spread the bottom layer with white frosting and add the first layer on. I place the remaining cake layers over the frosting. and I smooth it out gently. Then, I place a smaller one above to have a two-tier cake. I put the fondant balls around the cake. buttercream and two big fondant balls on the top. The ice creams with sprinkles will be the last step for decoration. Hey Lucy, it's done. Wow, so tasty. Hi Snow White, come here. That's the cake I made for you. Wow, I love it. Oh no, bad boy. It's okay. I'll make another rainbow cake for you. I mix egg, milk, flour, sugar, cooking oil, and sprinkles together. I 
take the bowl of melted white chocolate out of the microwave and mix it with food coloring. to decorate the cake after. I spread the bottom layer with brown frosting. First layer on. I place the remaining cake layers over the frosting. I put rainbow fondant around the cake. Next, I pour melted chocolate on the top of the cake. It's hot today, so I need an ice cream on the top. It's for you, Snow White. Thank you, my dear. Wow, a giant ice cream. I know what I'm gonna do today. Separate egg white and yolk. After that, I mix sugar and egg white together. And I pour milk, cooking oil, flour into yolk and keep mixing. melt some dark chocolate. together to get dark chocolate sponge for the cake. Next, I mix butter, sugar, and whipping cream for the frosting. I spread the bottom layer with white buttercream frosting and add the first layer on. I put 
the remaining layers over the frosting. I spread the white frosting around the cake. And brown frosting on the top. I set them in place gently. Frosting for the decoration. Of course, I cannot forget my ice cream covered with sprinkles. Wow! Delicious! roller skates to go out. I have to be more careful. The ingredients have arrived home safely. Let's start making a cake now. Firstly, I put flour, egg, milk, cooking oil, sugar into a bowl. and keep mixing. red fondant thinly. And cut it into this shape. I also do the same thing with the remaining ones. Then, I'll use the mold to create a rainbow heart shape. I spread the bottom layer with chocolate frosting and add the first layer on. Place the remaining cake layer over the frosting. After that, I spread chocolate frosting around the cake. And press gently to set it in place. Pour melted chocolate on the top of this cake. And I arrange the rainbow fondant balls around the base of the cake. Rainbow heart will be the final decoration for it. So 
pretty. I love it. Let's go to find my ball. Oh, why is it here? Bring it home and make a cake with me. I will mix egg, milk, cooking oil, and sugar together. Also add flour here and continue mixing. After all, I spread some mandem candies on the top of cake batter to make it sparkling. Next, I break fondants into small pieces and roll into the balls. Now, I spread the bottom layer with chocolate frosting and add the first layer on. Place the remaining cake layer over the frosting. I spread chocolate frosting around the cake. After that, I press gently to set it in place. Then, I pour rainbow melted chocolate on the top of this cake and let them flow down the cake body. Place the rainbow fondant balls around the cake base. And add mandem candies in the empty space on the cake body. A rainbow fondant ice cream will be the final decoration for my cake today. Wow, I love it! Delicious! Tasty! won't be able to eat cake today.
looks so pretty. I love it. Delicious! Don't mess something up anymore, okay? Oh, hi. Thanks for your milk. Looks so pretty. I love it.
delicious. Wow! So amazing! Let's make a cake now. Wow, I love it! Delicious! Tasty! sweet for you. Firstly, I will remove the leaves and dice the strawberries. Then, 
I puree the strawberries with sugar and condensed milk. Next, I filter this mixture through a sieve to get the liquid. Now, I mix the jelly powder with sugar. I boil strawberry juice with the jelly powder mixture and lemon juice. Pour the strawberry jelly mixture into a rectangular mold and cool it for 30 minutes. Now, I move on to making a sauce to eat with this dessert. I will boil strawberry juice with corn syrup, honey, lemon juice until it becomes a thick mixture. I cut the jelly into long pieces like this and mix them with sugar. After that, I arrange them in a box. And pour the sauce into the empty space in the middle. Delicious! Tasty! Come here and claim your reward! Oh, where does this road lead? Wow, it's an egg! Let's bring it home and make a cake now. I will mix egg, milk, cooking oil, and sugar to make the cake batter. Of course, flour and cocoa powder are essential. Now I will shred and melt a bar of white chocolate. I also add food coloring here to have colorful melted chocolate. I pour melted chocolate into puppet molds. And let them cool. I 
spread the bottom layer with white frosting and add the first layer on. I place the remaining cake layers over the frosting. After that, I spread chocolate frosting all over the cake. And smooth it evenly. I place poppet chocolate bars on the top of this cake in order red, yellow, green, and purple. yellow, green, and purple melted chocolate around the edges of the cake in positions corresponding to the chocolate bars. Finally, I pipe chocolate butter cream around the cake base. It looks so pretty. I love it. cream in here and start making a cake now. I mix egg, milk, cooking oil, and sugar together. Also add flour and cocoa powder here. Now is to make them become rainbow fondant balls. Spread the bottom layer with white frosting and add the first layer on. I place the remaining cake layer over the frosting. After that, I spread chocolate frosting around the cake Press gently to set it in place. Then, I arrange the rainbow fondant balls in vertical rows around the cake body. I will pour melted chocolate in rainbow color order on the top of this cake. Favorite ice cream will be the final decoration for the cake. Wow, I love it! Delicious! Tasty! It's so bad. I can't deliver soft drinks to customers today. My soft drink can't be delivered now. I have to think of another way.
First, I will dice the watermelon and carrot. in a blender to get the juices. I will make dried butterfly pea flowers turn the water to blue color by microwaving them together. I did it successfully. Next, I boil the watermelon juice with sugar, milk, and honey. is done when the mixture becomes sticky. I also do the same with other juices. Then, I boil jelly powder with water and sugar. mixture into each jam bowls. After that, I pour jelly mixtures into the bottle-shaped molds and let them cool in 30 minutes. Wow. It looks so pretty. I love it. Thank you, Unicorn, for giving me today's baking idea. Firstly, I mix egg, milk, cooking oil, and sugar together. Also add flour, cocoa powder here and keep mixing. Next, I will make buttercream with butter, sugar, and whipping cream. I 
also add food coloring here to have rainbow buttercream. I spread the bottom layer with white frosting and add the first layer on. I place the remaining cake layer over the frosting. After all, I spread chocolate frosting all over the cake and smooth it in this way. Then, I pipe the buttercream to create a rainbow shape on the cake body. Don't forget to add the clouds. Next, I pipe swirls of rainbow-colored buttercream around the edge of the cake. Finally, I attach sprinkles onto the clouds and the cake body. Delicious! Tasty! No! I want a new pair of shoes for party today! Thank you! This is what I need today!
beautiful. I love it. Delicious! Wow, so beautiful. Let my camera capture this moment. Oh no, why did it turn out like this? I have to make a cake in another way. Firstly, I will break and melt the chocolate bar. cooking oil and sugar together. Next, I pour flour here and keep mixing. Strawberry jam and melted chocolate will be the last ingredients for the cake batter. white frosting and add the first layer on. I place the remaining cake layers over the frosting. After that, I spread chocolate frosting all over the cake. And smooth it evenly. star-shaped dots of rainbow buttercream around the cake edge. I arrange sprinkles into a heart shape on the surface of this cake. At the end, I put sprinkles around the cake base. so pretty. I love it. Today is an unlucky day for me. Don't be sad. Let me make something delicious for you. Thank you. I will make egg, milk, cooking oil, and sugar together. flour, strawberry powder here and keep mixing. Let's 
watch my magical block of fondant create its siblings. Now, I will twist two fondant strands of the same color together. I spread the bottom layer with white frosting and add the first layer on. I place the remaining cake layers over the frosting. After that, I spread white frosting all over the cake and smooth it evenly. Then, I wrap the twisted fondant strands around the cake body in order from dark to light pink. Finally, I arrange rainbow fondant balls diagonally on top of the cake. Wow, I love it! Delicious! Tasty! Let's make a cake to celebrate right now.
Wow, I love it! Delicious! Tasty! Yummy! oil together chocolate out of the microwave. And mix it with food coloring. I spread the bottom layer with brown frosting. And add the first layer on. remaining cake layers over the frosting. And I smooth it out gently. Next, I pour melted chocolate on the top of the cake. ice cream in order to decorate. white. 
I mix vanilla, milk, and cooking oil with the yolk. For the white, I will whisk it up with sugar. After that, I mix the bowls of yolk and white together. Now I pour flour, cocoa powder here, and keep mixing. I spread the bottom layer with white frosting and add the first layer on. I place the remaining cake layers over the frosting. After that, I spread chocolate frosting all over the cake and smooth it evenly. Then I place a smaller one above to have a two-tier cake. I place rainbow fondant balls around the base of both tiers. in the top of the cake. Wow, I love it! Delicious!
Looks so pretty, I love it. Delicious. Hi, Cowie. This is your food. Don't worry. I'll leave you alone. Ah, I need this egg. Hmm, let's go home to make a cake now. First, I crack an egg through a sieve to separate yolk and white. I mix vanilla, milk, cooking oil with the yolk. For the white, I will whisk it up with sugar. After that, I mix the bowls of yolk and white together. Now I pour flour, cocoa powder here and keep mixing. I take the bowl of melted white chocolate out of the microwave and mix it with food coloring. I spread the bottom layer with white frosting and add the first layer on. I place the remaining cake layers over the frosting. After that, I spread chocolate frosting all over the cake. And smooth it evenly. Place a smaller one above to have a two-tier cake. Now I wrap the rainbow fondant braids along the body of the first tier. Next, I pour rainbow melted chocolate on the top of the first tier. I 
piped swirls of chocolate buttercream around the edge of the second tier. At the end, I place some sprinkles along the body of the second tier. So beautiful! I love it! Oh no! Hi! Do you still have some mandem candies? Here you are! Thanks! For you. Thank you so much. hungry. Go home to find something to eat. Oh no, there is
is nothing left. I will have to make myself something to eat. Firstly, I will mix egg, milk, cooking oil, vanilla, and sugar together. flour, cocoa powder into the cake batter and keep mixing. rainbow fondants in the fridge. Next, I place each block of fondants on the cutting board. Break it into small pieces. And shape them into fondant balls. Spread the bottom layer with white frosting and add the first layer on. I place the remaining cake layer over the frosting. After all, I spread purple frosting all over the cake and smooth it evenly. Oh, they're the same color as the cake, so now I won't need them anymore. Now, I arrange rainbow fondant balls around the cake body. Pour white melted chocolate over the top of the cake and let it drip a little down the body. I insert a twisted rainbow onto the top of the cake. Finally, I place a fondant sun on the base of the rainbow. Wow, I love it! Delicious! No, I need chocolate for a new cake.
looks so pretty. I love it. Yummy. Delicious. <laughs> Oops, don't play in my kitchen. Get out. I need to make a cake right now. <sighs> Firstly, I will break and melt this chocolate bar. To make the cake batter, I mix egg, milk, cooking oil, and sugar together. Next, I add flour here and keep mixing. white chocolate in the microwave to melt for 15 minutes. Melted dark chocolate will be the last ingredient for this cake batter. After that, I mix food coloring with melted white chocolate. Wow, they look like rainbow. I spread the bottom layer with white frosting and add the first layer on. I place the remaining cake layers over the frosting. After that, I spread chocolate frosting all over the cake and smooth it evenly. I place a small cake above to have a two-tier one. rainbow melted chocolate on the top of the second tier. Next, I pipe dots of rainbow buttercream around the base of two tiers. I put some sprinkles on the cake bodies. Insert a special heart with fondant in the center of this cake. Wow. It looks so pretty. I love it. <laughs> oh no, my cake. Quickly, make a new one. I will make it with egg, milk, cooking oil, and sugar. I also add flour and cocoa powder to this mixture.
have some fondants in the fridge. I think you've seen the twisted rainbow decorated on my cakes. And here's how to do it. Spread the bottom layer with white frosting and add the first layer on. I place the remaining cake layer over the frosting. I spread chocolate frosting around the cake. After that, I press gently to set them in place. Next, I place a smaller cake above. I pipe swirls of buttercream from the base of the first tier cake in rainbow color order. Put my twisted rainbow and clouds on the top of this cake. And add some star sprinkles to finish it. Delicious. Tasty. Oh no. I have to clean it up to make a cake right now. Firstly, I put egg, milk, cooking oil, and sugar into a bowl. Mix them up. I also add flour and cocoa powder in this mixture. And keep mixing. After that, I will melt some chocolate. Cocoa powder, condensed milk in here. Now, I have a mixture of solids like this. Next, I will make it become many cocoa balls. I spread the bottom layer with white frosting and add the first layer on. I place the remaining cake layer over the frosting. I spread chocolate frosting around the cake.
After that, I press gently to set it in place. Now, I place a smaller one above to have a two-tier cake. I will pour colorful melted chocolate on the top of this cake. After that, I arrange cocoa balls all over the cake. And also add a white heart and a yellow bow by fondant to finish the cake decorating. Wow, I love it! Delicious! Tasty!
beautiful. Wow! M&M &M candy. Let's make a sweet cake with this. delicious. Oh no, I don't have money. Let me make you something delicious. Firstly, I mix egg, milk, cooking oil, and sugar together. powder here and keep mixing.
I still have some fondants in the fridge, so I will make them become many fondant balls. I spread the bottom layer with white frosting and add the first layer on. I place the remaining cake layer over the frosting. I spread chocolate frosting around the cake. After that, I press gently to set it in place. Then, I arrange rainbow fondant balls around the cake base. I also arrange the chocolate bars above the fondant rows. Next, I pipe swirls of rainbow buttercream around the edge of the cake. At the end, I place the brown fondant balls in the center of the buttercream swirls. Looks so pretty, I love it. Oh, what is this? It still has candies. Let's make a cake now. Firstly, I put egg, milk, cooking oil, sugar, and flour into a bowl. Then, mix them up. I also add mandem candies into the cake mixture. In the fridge, I still have some special chocolate bars. I will cut them into small pieces. Now, I spread the bottom layer with chocolate frosting and add the first layer on. I place the remaining cake layer over the frosting. I spread chocolate frosting around the cake. After that, I press gently to set it in place. Next, I place a smaller cake above, so I have a two-tier one now. After that, I arrange chocolate pieces around the body of two cake tiers. I will finish my cake with mandem candies. Wow! 
Wow, I love it. Delicious. Tasty. Sit here and wait for some minutes. I'll give you a delicious dessert. I will dice the watermelon, orange, and grapes one by one. Soak dried butterfly pea flowers in the hot water to get the blue color. Now, I boil watermelon with sugar, milk, and honey to become a sticky mixture. Also do the same with the other fruits. After that, I melt some gelatin leaves with water. Melted gelatin into each of the jam bowls and stir them well. It's great to have a friend who can use magic, unicorn. Let's see what amazing desserts I can make with them. First, I will dice the watermelon, carrot, mango, and avocado. in a blender to get the juices. When hot water is poured into dried butterfly pea flowers, they will fade to a blue color. Then, 
Squeeze a few drops of lemon here, the water will turn purple color. Next, I boil the watermelon juice with sugar, milk, and honey. This step is done when the mixture becomes sticky. I also do the same with other juices. Then, I melt the jelly powder in the microwave. Now, I pour the melted jelly into each jam bowl and mix them up. After that, I pour them into the fish-shaped molds. Wow, I love it! Delicious! Tasty! Yummy! Wow, beautiful flowers! Oh no, I can't buy it! But I have a new idea! Thank you.
Delicious. Tasty. Oh no, they are not toys. I'm sorry, but what can I do with them? Let's make a cake now. It 
looks so pretty. I love it. Delicious! So normal. Ah, uh, I have a new idea. Delicious! Tasty! Rainbow is coming back. Let's make a rainbow cake now. I make my cake today with egg, milk, cooking oil, sugar, and flour. to mix them up. Then, I add melted chocolate to the cake mixture and keep mixing. Now, 
I spread the bottom layer with white frosting and add the first layer on. I place the remaining cake layer over the frosting. I spread chocolate frosting around the cake. After that, I press gently to set it in place. Next, I place a smaller cake above it to have a two-tier one. I think I'm making a cake which has the most rainbow in my baking journey. To make it look like the sky, I will add some clouds, stars, and hearts on this cake. They are made with fondant. Wow! It looks so pretty. I love it. Cake with them?
Delicious. Tasty. Wow. Garden for this bird.
Wow, I love it. Delicious. Yummy.